We're in Sydney, Australia! Can you do, girls? We got here yesterday. I can't cope. If you haven't watched the travel vlog, watch it. Watch it right now. Welcome back to another video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and comment and all that good stuff. And yeah, we're in Australia and this is my first week in Sydney vlog. Girlies, we have a lot to do today. It is going to be a big busy day and we're running on very little sleep. Because if you watched my last vlog, you'll know that yesterday when we got off our flight, we went to the beach and stuff and we were so tired, we didn't sleep at all on the plane, we decided to go for a big nap. And we thought it was gonna be a nap, but it turned out to be a full-blown sleep and we slept for 10 hours. So, which is more than I sleep on a normal night. We didn't sleep all night. I think I slept maybe an hour and a half all night, I would say. So we're gonna try and stay up all day today and get a good sleep tonight. I'm already tired though, so. But yes, today's a big day. We're gonna go into East Gardens because I know that there's a Commonwealth branch, a bank branch out there, so we're gonna go there. There's also a Telstra store, so I'm gonna set up our Sims with Telstra, I think that's how you say it. And then we're gonna come home and set up our tax numbers and Medicare, hopefully. So I'm gonna take you with us today and all week for my first Sydney vlog. And yeah, I'm so excited, guys. I'm feeling so happy to be here. I honestly can't believe that we're actually here. It's actually happened. Let's go. Also, our temporary apartment is in Maroubra for four weeks. I'm obsessed with this apartment. I wish that it was a longer term thing. Like I wish it was a six month, 12 month thing because there's so many windows, so much light getting in, which is exactly what I am looking for in an apartment. All the bright light comes in, the windows in the bedroom, like look at those windows. So much brightness, it's stunning here. But yeah, let's get started with the day. And come with me today, girls. Ah, come on the bus into East Gardens, we're going to get our sims and banks and all sorted. The public transport seems pretty straightforward. It's similar to London where you tap on, tap off, so. Thank you. We need to buy a car. <laughs> okay. That would be handy. So we're gonna get a bite of lunch first. I'm starving. I have my breakfast this morning. We went to the food court, went to this place called Charlie Chan's and got the rice and two toppings and he got noodles and two toppings. Some feeding. The chicken was like pink and I just thought it was like obviously thigh meat or whatever. It's like pinky chicken. Like it doesn't look raw, it just looks like pinky so it kind of turned me off it. I just had the rice. Didn't bother rolling though. Now I'm hungry still. Nightmare. Time to go and find the bank and get set up. I'm gonna see what's in cotton on. Everyone always talks about this place from here so see what it's about. 50% off girls, what a me. Ooh. We got all sorted at the bank, we got bank set up, we got uh, Telstra mobile like sims set up. It was a very productive day, happy with that. Now we're going to go and do a quick shop in Aldi to get a few bits and that'll be us. 10 out of 10. Just it's different when there's lemonade. When we were in London last week I asked for a strawberry side refresh with lemonade and they didn't give me lemonade, they put water in it, it's just not the same. It's still nice, it's just not as refreshing as lemonade. Sponsored walk back to the apartment. I don't think I'll ever get sick of that view. Beautiful sky. I love how this place has loads of windows, like it actually is ideal. I don't know how I would feel if it was like a really dark, dull apartment. I feel like we get perfect lighting in here, like all around. Bedrooms, everything. We had a productive day though, didn't we, Owen? Mm -hmm. Sim cards, banks. I'm gonna look up the TFN now. Apparently it's easy enough to do, so we're gonna do that now. And we've been chilling. I've applied for our TFNs which is like our number that we need to work. And now we're sitting down having some duck. We got it out of, where's this one out of? Aldi. Aldi. Good morning. It is our second day in Sydney. Just around the same outfit as I was wearing yesterday because we are thinking of going into the opera house and stuff this evening for a few drinks. Like in and around that area. I don't even know what it's called. It's the harbor or whatever. We're thinking of going in there for drinks like quite early, like maybe four. But we want to go down to the beach first, so we just threw on what we had yesterday. And then we'll come up and shower and get ready. Yeah, another morning I've woke up a little bit sick, to be honest. Not gonna lie. Yeah, I definitely have woke up with a bit of a sore throat. Body aches, I think I'm getting like a flu from all of the aircon on the planes. I did feel it coming on the past couple of days, but it definitely hit me, like hit me last night. It was really bad last night. I've kind of sat about all morning. It's now nearly 11 and I'm like, let's just get up and go out and do something. I do, I feel okay, like it comes and goes kind of thing. Um, I don't feel totally like crap, but I want to watch what I drink today because if we're going out tonight and I'm hanging tomorrow and got a flu, that'll not be a good combo. So I think I'll just watch what I do. But I'll bring you with us today. I'm having a great time so far. I'm not feeling sad or anything yet. It's still excitement. I still feel like kind of holiday mode. So that's the crack. But I'll take you with us whatever we do today. Home sweet home. 
First coffee in Australia, guys. This is just a random wee cafe, so I don't know if it'll be any good, but. Oh, it tastes like the one at the port. What do they call that one? Lost and found. Tastes like lost and found, guys. We both got the chicken burgers. This is from Chalk Espresso. It's on the Maribra beach. Thank you. The one just made me climb the whole way from there, from the beach to here. I think he's trying to tell me something, guys. I think he's trying to get me skinny. My calves are burning. Didn't sign up for this. Joking, it was actually a really nice walk, but I'm so unfit, it's not even funny. But we're going to the shopping center because I stupidly forgot my laptop charger, like a stupid bitch. So we need to get a replacement for that. That's the vibe. Hey, we're just gonna get ready. We're going out tonight. Why am I not focused? I'm not focusing, am I? First night out in Sydney. Don't mind my skin. It is all broken out in the flight all over here. But what can you do? Um, it's just got really bad today. I've also came down with something. I feel like I'm a little bit sick. I think it's all the aircon on the throat, like stuck in the back of my throat. Yeah, can't wait. I will take some clips for you. So glad to get my Giorgio Armani back before I left. I'm also so pale at the minute and I can't be bothered putting on tan. I'll talk to you as when I'm fully ready, kind of sleepy. We've got ready and we're coming down to the Maribra, what's it called, parade, to have a drink with Aaron and Brian. We're going to the strip. We're going, going to the strip. strip. With your gorgeous handbag. Let me see you. Give me a twirl. Wow. Owen's made me breakfast because I'm so sick. Aren't they, Oh, you're doing But he's made me some breakfast, some eggs, sausages, mushrooms, an egg in a cup. Oh, I'm stunning. I am stunning, but I'm actually buzzing. We're waiting on the bus, we're gonna go and see Bondi Junction for the first time. Still not really feeling good today, but yesterday we just sat in the house all day, didn't do anything. But today we thought it'd be best to get out and do something, so we're gonna see it. And that's the vibe. Take you with us. Just landed at Westfield. This is like the big shopping center, it's like the big daddy of shopping centers. So we're stopping in here to see the crack. I went to a place called Flame Grill or something. It's like Portuguese chicken. And I got the bowl and added halloumi into it. Came with chips. I'll go with that beef noodle place. And got some noodles. He says they're unreal. I taste them. Just stopped and got away and needed gelato. She said 15% for bank holiday or something because it's bank holiday today. And I thought it was 15% off, but it was actually 15% on. So, delicious though. It's Bondi, guys. First time in it. Beautiful. Not as big as I thought it was going to be. You think it was going to be bigger? It's not disappointing. It's still beautiful. <laughs> bin system. These are all the bins. We don't know what red, yellow, and green means. Yellow is recycling, red's general waste, and green is food and garden. Products. We're just walking down to get a wee bite to eat. We're getting breakfast. This is our first breakfast out, isn't it, Owen? But look, guys, look at our home. I actually can't do it, you know. But we put on our first load of washing today. Big accomplishment. I'll show you what we got for breakfast. I can't wait for a nice coffee again. I think we're going to go to that chalk place that we went for lunch yesterday or two days ago. So, yeah. For eggs Benedict, Gorge, Steak Huh? Looks good. It does look good. Days like ease. You made my iced latte in this cup again, same as that time in London. I give it in a warm cup for some reason. I have literally been world's worst vlogger. I'm so sorry for this first week in Sydney, but I got sick. Today's the first day I've been feeling a bit better. Don't get me wrong, I've been on like good vibrations, like about being in Sydney, like I'm all good there. Sorry, there's a wild lot of noise. I had to open that window, it's too warm. When I say I got like the plane flu, I have not been well. Do you hear the birds? Tonight, we're going to Vivid Sydney, which is like basically some sort of light show and I think there's like talks and live music and I think it's just like I don't actually know what it is or why they do it it's gonna be really good so I am excited for that we haven't even been in Darling Harbour yet so we haven't seen the Opera House or the Harbour Bridge or any of them I guess we're gonna see it all tonight which is exciting so even saying sorry my mind is blank at the moment since I've been here I haven't put on any tan and I feel like a zombie it's only Tuesday now so I was like I may as well just wait until the weekend put on tan mum just sent me a picture of all my posts I literally have lived there like 10 years and I haven't got that much post since I bloody moved in there, never mind, just when I've moved. Sorry girls, our conversation was cut short. I had to talk to mommy there, but I'm all ready. I didn't put on eyelashes tonight, I just can't be bothered. This is what I'm gonna wear. This is this wee midi skirt I got from Primark and this white vest that I got in cotton on. We've come to the harbour to see Vivid Sydney for the first time. It's actually finishing on Saturday, it's been on for a month. Do you feel spitting coming? This is the first time we've been anywhere that's like kinda Real city vibes. You built up like 
skyscraper vibes, but loving it. So excited. We are hungry though, so we are looking for food. Look at these vibes. Oh, no. Just came to this wee place here, Adria. For no particular reason, we just seen it and thought it looked nice, so here we are. The light show is actually happening here. Well, this thing's burning the head off me. Cool. Last night at the harbour was stunning. It's so surreal. Like, it's literally the most beautiful thing. I don't know, it's just such a vibe. There was a nice buzz around it and it was only a Tuesday, so it wasn't too busy. Apparently, in like busy nights, you can't even see the ground. I'm sort of glad we went on a night that wasn't busy to start with. I think we'll still go back at the weekend just for the finale of Vivid. I'm feeling a bit better again this morning. I'm just gradually getting better. My, vo my voice is still all messed up from my throat. But yeah, I thought we were going to be able to see like the Opera House and all. We weren't. It was actually way at the other side. Light was probably really dark there. I apologise. Look at the gorgeous skies today. Perfect, thank you. <laughs> what a cutie. I haven't updated you, so I've been such a bad vlogger, but this is the last day of the vlog because it is our seventh day in Sydney, which means this is my first week in Sydney up. We're going to do our white card course, which is basically like a CSR course from home. It's your health and safety regulations for working on sites and stuff. So I have, I'm just going to, Owen obviously needs it because he's a spark. I might need it, I don't know. I just want to get it just in case. What the fuck is that? Just the size of that thing. If I can't get office work, then obviously I'm going to have to work in a site. But yeah, I'll take his with us today too. It's going to be an all day course, but it's boring. It's $99 for anybody who wants to know. So. Cheers. Halfway through the course, guys, it's lunchtime. So into this cafe that's near the place. Got chicken rolls, some chips. It's done. Lots of coffee needed today. I was out of that wee like hatch thing. It's not deadly. <laughs> There she is guys. We're being tourists and we came down to the Opera House area. Look how gorgeous she is. Owen's got this tasting beer thing. It's a mix of like eels and pilsner, whatever the f that is. And I'm getting a wee seltzer but it hasn't come yet. I'm waiting patiently for that. Mm. Vibes guys. Finished our course, guys. It was hand. When was the last time I spoke to you? Oh, yes. Yeah, so I told you we were coming to the harbour. So here's Harbour Bridge. Can't really see it, but here's the Opera House. I think I got other footage of it, so I'll show you that. But we're in a bar now. It's called the Squire or something. Squire's Lounge or something. Just having a couple of drinks. I finally found a wine that's nice because all my wine since I've got here has been like bitter. Oh, this is good. We seriously need to get jobs and stop messing about and drinking. Guys, look at this view. These wee truffle and mushroom and truffle aren't chini balls, they're called. It's like some sort of ricey thing inside them. They're unreal. But what the hell is my life? 